drinking alone, I was going to kill myself. Hey. Yep. I'm off the wagon again. Uh-huh. Accept it and move on. <laughs> oh, my God. Press my laundry. Oh, oh Trent. How are you doing? I'm good. Like this. Thanks. See, first of all, your character in this is is not exactly likable, mm -hmm. but there is a sort of empathy you develop for him over the course of the film because you can sense that there's he's the way he acts is out of sort of insecurity. And you're not really given any sort of backstory about him in the film, but was there something that you kind of worked up in your head to sort of understand him better? I just saw this guy as someone who isn't a bad guy or doesn't think of himself as a bad guy. Because I think, generally speaking, if you think somebody's a jerk, they don't think they're a jerk. They just think they're doing what they can do. And 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 he just doesn't have the tools to do it in a better um, in a better way. You know, he's trying to help this kid. In his mind, he's doing what this kid needs. By anyone else's standards, he's really offensive and <laughs> is is yeah. is. You we know. have similarly bad parenting skills. Yeah. The way I treat my son, you'd think yeah. on the outside, like when I read it, I was like, "This is pretty harsh." And then I was, you know, she's just trying to to give him some tough love and get, you know have him be prepared for what's going to be out there. You know, people are going to make fun of his lazy eye, and she wants to do it first, so right. he is prepared right. for it. Exactly. You know? And she doesn't think she's being mean to him. She thinks she's giving him the best advice ever, being the best mom ever, and just right. like he thinks he's being. A great new, you know, role model for a poor, you know, young, young Liam. Yeah, well, in that, in that sense, you guys would actually, your characters would be a perfect match well, we for each other. Together. You should I'm be together. I'm thinking at the start of the movie, yes. Betty thinks it's going to be it might happen. their summer. Well, it might actually end up happening sometime. That's in the way, way back, yeah. too. Way, 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 that's back. The, <laughs> way, way, way back. Well, your Allison, your character is so much fun. She's so boisterous and just like kind of an over-the-top character. But again, we can all sort of recognize this woman. It's kind of an amalgamation of about 25 people in my life. But um, uh, but what I love about her is that I, I know how much pain she's in, and that's what I recognized with her. I just it, she just breaks my heart when you see people who are working so hard to show you that they're fine. This is going to be the best summer ever. Who cares? If my husband left me. He's gay. So what? This is going to be fantastic. You know, she just is yeah. like. Just overcompensating, like you can't believe, and and she was so much fun to play and so exhausting. I, I really, uh, <laughs> you know, it was a lot of fun. Though. Well, and she has some of the greatest lines, like there, especially in her like sort of opening scene. It's just one zinger after another. Where you was it hard to keep a straight face when you're saying these outrageous things? No, because I okay. felt the pressure of having. I knew that I had to drive that whole scene. And it was a mm -hmm. bit, and I I did not. I did not have. Um, no, I don't want to say I didn't have fun. I had a, a lot of fun, but I felt. I was on my game. I couldn't. Uh, and you're, and well, you've you've spouted a lot of Aaron Sorkin dialogue too, so that probably helps with Lord. that sort of banter. Yes. Yeah. That was uh, that was good training ground for for Betty. And what was it like working with uh, two directors? You know, Jim and Nat. This is their directorial debut. Was there sort of a, a delineation of their roles, or was it much more of a collaborative? You know, sort of. It was of really collaborative. Relationship? Mm -hmm. they, uh, yeah, I thought they were they worked great together. They um, complemented each other they nicely. Did. They um they had different two different styles but uh it was it was kind of sweet it won't only occasionally would i get oh, oh I, you know a direction from jim and i'd say nat already talked to me and uh, uh -huh. he totally disagrees with you so <laughs> just, were... just creating chaos no. on the set <laughs> no they, they were, were great they were great together For breaking entertainment news and more, follow at HitFix on Twitter or visit HitFix.com.